Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel Diamonds and Washi. My name's Katie and if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing if you'd like to see lots more diamond painting content. And if you're back, welcome back. Um, please don't mind if my voice is a little bit froggy in this video. I am currently battling off the Ronosaurus, as I heard my friend Randy call it the other day. Um, so anyway, <laughs> back to business. Um, what I have for you guys today is the, um, is a video in my small shop haul series. And I have just a few packages to get into with you today, including one that is a mystery package that we will take a look and see what's in there. Um, it's quite possible I ordered something and just flat forgot about it. I mean, that actually is a thing that happens. <laughs> anyway, in these small shop haul videos, I like to just share with you all um, not only about some different small shops that are in the community, but also um, just some of my favorite things. So you will see some repeat shops in here. Um, from time to time, but I also want to let you guys know that I am more than open to if you own a small shop uh, that's related to crafting and diamond painting, or if you know of one that you haven't seen me share about before, I am always open to suggestions. So feel free to send that my way. You can leave it either in a comment on this video or send me a message over on Instagram or shoot me an email. I've always got all the info down below in the description. Um, and I'm always happy to take a look and if something catches my eye, then I would love to make a purchase. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into what I have to share with you all today. So, okay, let me shift these to the side. Let's start with this little package because I'm really excited. I'm excited about all these. Who am I kidding? Um, now, of course, I'm going to link to all of these small shops down below in the description, as well as their social media platforms, whether that's an Instagram account or a Facebook group or anything like that. And I would absolutely love for you guys to go and check out these different small shops in the community, even if you're not um, looking to make a purchase necessarily right away, just giving them a follow um, on social media can be a great way to support them. So this package is from Shiny Shaza. Um, Sharon over there makes gorgeous resin goodies, including diamond painting trays. And she recently shared that she had um, uh, created a new design with a different kind of spout, and I was really curious to give them a try. So, it uh, looks like we also got a little piece of candy. Yum. <laughs> and packing peanuts. Do not eat. Cute packaging. Now, on the inside of the box, by the way, there were notes about caring for your resin tray because resin can take a bit to set. Uh, so just keep that in mind. But look, oh my gosh. I love these colors so much. It's a pastel rainbow. So yes, this is a newer tray design um, that has the spout on the end. And oh my gosh, I love her trays. Oh, I don't know if I've noticed that before. Do you see the branding on the side? Come on camera, shiny Shaza, love it. She's always coming up with new and beautiful things to put into her shop and oh, it's on both sides. And I just love what she does. So I'm excited to give this one a try. Keep an eye out in one of my upcoming whipping chats. I will be sure to give this one a try so we can uh, see how it works in action. Since we're on a trays theme, I'll go ahead and open another tray package. This one is from Unimade and I had picked up um, one or two colors in the set of custom orders. I want to say that this was from the December round of custom orders. And as I was looking at, I was looking at the ahead at the kits that I wanted to work on and realizing like, oh, there's a couple of colors that I'm kind of missing. Uh, so anyway, look, she's on YouTube. I was in one of her lives the other day and it was so relaxed and so fun. Um, I'll link to her YouTube channel below, but she is so, 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 so sweet. Okay. Yeah, this is from December. She included a little card. Oh, that's so sweet. You're so sweet, Municorny. Then we have some goodies in here. Look at all the Christmas themed stuff. Okay. And then a cute little freebie, little ornament. Oops. I'm a klutz tonight, you guys. I, I apologize. So, um, Muni Maids Trays, here's all of her social media info. I'll link to them, like I said. Um, they are just fantastic trays and they do sell out really, really quickly. Um, so it's the kind of thing that I recommend following her on Twitter because that's where she posts 
Uh, shop updates, I feel like that's the quickest way to be able to keep track of when drops are coming and what she's restocking. And I think she even put up a full restock calendar for the month of January. So um, anyway, this set, oops, <laughs> is upside down. Um, I'm excited about this one. I was browsing her custom selection and under their um, choice section, they have a couple of different colors where um, just the style of the filament is such that you don't necessarily know exactly what color combo you're gonna get when it prints. So this came as a set and the way that it works is she'll print one and send it to you and if you want to take that one, you can. And if you want her to try another printing and see if there's a different color combo that you like better, she can do that. And I think she can do that up to three times. Um, this was the first one that printed and I had asked her to print a second one and in the meantime was like actually I'm sorry I really like the first one a lot so I the name of this one was this pastel unicorn or just unicorn but look at the pink on the lid I like that it has this little lip here and then the blue and the yellow that goes into pink and then this pink stopper so I am so happy with this one and I thought this is so perfect for spring so I'm really Really happy about that one. And then this, if I remember right, this is just a solid color that I, yeah, that I was sorely missing in my, uh, as a color option. And, I mean, you can see what the color is, but. So this is just a basic solid orange. <laughs> and I know that Halloween has passed, but I absolutely will use something like this in the fall next, this year next year, this year, <laughs> maybe even in like in the summer or something, if I have like a really tropical and fun piece. So yay, just a couple more colors to add to my collection. So let's keep going. Thank you, Muni Maid, for making such beautiful trays. Um, this is the mystery package, <laughs> the one that I'm like, I'm actually not 100% sure what is in here. Um, so <laughs> if it's like, oh, this was a, a Christmas gift for my brother or something, then I'll just edit around it. But um, let's take a look. Or did I just forget? Okay. What is... <gasps> Okay, I am going to blame Steph. I don't know if this is from Steph or not. I Am I going to include this? I feel like they sent this to me. She sent Whoever sent this to me did so thinking that there was no way that I would include it like on my channel because they would think that it would make me uncomfortable or whatever. But look, I... <laughs> it's going to make me cough. Oh my gosh. Um... I love dragons and I don't even remember the context that this came up in, but Steph had found it. Steph is drills are a girl's best friend over on Instagram and she posted it on her feed and was like, Hey Katie, I found something for you. Look, my friends, like a lot of the people here on like YouTube and Instagram and the community, we really tease each other super, super hard and we do everything we can to make each other like uncomfortable and kind of, um, uh, push the limits sometimes of what's socially acceptable. So this is just like an amazing irreverent gift. <laughs> and I cannot believe that this happened. Oh my gosh. So I am so, so, so sorry if I've offended your delicate sensibilities, but I hope that you will appreciate the silliness and the humor that went into that. And, um, I think it's going to stay in this video because I'm kind of taking it as a challenge. So, I gotta find out where that shop is, so I guess I can link it below for you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, my friends. Anyway, I don't even know how to move on from that. Um, I have two more packages and they both have pens. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hysterical. And I know my husband is sitting over on the couch and I know he's probably dying to know why I was just like losing my ever loving mind with giggling. So that'll be hilarious to show him. Anyway, this package, this is from uh, Diamond Pen Pal over on Etsy. I really, really love their diamond painting pens. Ooh, I don't want to show you my invoice. Uh, they have some really beautiful and unique blanks that they create. Cute little wintry themed goodies. This is like an, 
ornament what am I looking at here okay oops freebies so yay cute I am a klutz today oh my goodness uh but I really really enjoy uh the different blanks that they create and I I like their turning styles they were the originators of the uh, roll stop pens or the no roll pens that are flat on the one side. I'll show you once I get this out. They did package the tips separately in this little bag. Uh, but this one I couldn't resist because I thought this would go perfectly with one of the kits I'm planning to work on later this month. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Look. <gasps> Okay, you guys, so you can see here on this end, this is flat. So what that means is, especially if you're working on like an inclined surface or something like that, um, and you bump your table or something, this is not gonna roll because it's flat on the side. I am, I'm picky when it comes to my pens and how um, comfortable they are to hold. And I have not found the flat side to be uncomfortable at all but look at the snowflakes in there. I love, love, love the swirls of silver glitter and like the blue. I love this so much. Again, I am obsessed with the different pours they do for their blanks, but here's again, a multi-placer and a single placer. So yay, wintry happiness. And then we just have this last package, which you might be starting to get familiar with the, the way this package looks. This is from C'est Plus Beau Tour over in France. This was one of those pens that I was like, I'm afraid this is going to be the one that got away <laughs> because I kept missing it. This particular style of blank I really badly wanted. So, um, here is their info. They do most of their drops. Well, they do all of their drops either through their Facebook group with a random comment picker where they do a right to buy or um, they do fast fingers drops on Etsy. So I recommend definitely joining their Facebook group because that is where they share all of that info and what's going to be happening day to day as far as restocks go. But I'm really happy with the quality of their pens and the shipping is not prohibitive from France to the US. And then if you're in the, if you're in Europe, then hopefully that makes it even um, more of a feasible option for you. But oh my gosh. Okay, so this has pink, a couple of different shades of pink mesh. There's glitter and there's some of that white mesh. There were a couple of blanks in this style that were dropped both in the random comment picker section and the Etsy fast fingers section. And I kept missing them. <laughs> and I was like, oh my gosh, this is one of the um, pens from them that I've loved the most in a long time. I really hope I can snag it. And I was thrilled when I did. And I just think that's so, so pretty. So again, I will link to their Facebook group and their Etsy shop. And I'd suggest following them in both places. So you guys, this is it for this week's small shop haul. Um, I hope this was fun for you <laughs> and that you enjoyed not only the beautiful goodies, but also the like highly inappropriate and hilarious um, present that I have to go track down who in the world that's from. <laughs> I am cracking up. That really, that was a laugh I needed tonight. But like I said, my friends, if you have a small shop, like if you own one, and or you know of one that you'd like for me to try, uh, you're always more than welcome to share those with me and I will take a look. If nothing else, I'll favorite their shop or bookmark their shop so that I can keep an eye out. If something doesn't catch my eye right up front, then I will um, keep an eye out and hopefully something will in the near future. <laughs> but anyway, my friends, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Let me know if you have any questions whatsoever about these small shops. And thank you to these small shop owners for creating such gorgeous, beautiful, um, wonderfully crafted goodies that we can use with our crafting. So um, yeah, that's it, you guys. Thanks again for watching. If you're not already subscribed and want to see more diamond painting content from me, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the bell to be notified when I share new videos. Otherwise, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.